Hi guys and girls, it's Reef Man, and this weekend was Reef Palooza 2018 in Anaheim, California. If you haven't been to one of these shows like Reef Palooza or Macna, I would really recommend going. They're a really great way to just to get to meet uh, a whole bunch of hobbyists and get to see a whole bunch of different kinds of coral and talk to people that that actually grow them and propagate them from all the different shops. You learn quite a bit, um, even if you don't end up buying anything. Uh, if you are looking to buy things, though, these are definitely the places to go. Uh, all of the major vendors that you'll t you'll see online, like Unique Corals and Worldwide Corals and so on, are going to be at these shows with booths. So if you're looking for something in particular, uh, then you can actually talk to the people at the booth and they can either have it there for you, you can see it in person, or you could, you know, I'll probably set up a, a sale and have it shipped to you from their store. You also get a chance to talk to manufacturers like Ecotech Marine or Red Sea. Um, they all have booths there. So if you have questions about like Kessel lights or Radeon lights or uh, you know how to take care of LPS or something like that, you can talk to the people at the booths and they will be able to give you a lot of information right there in person. You can also get fish at these shows. These are, uh, these are Bengali cardinals, but you can get a lot of captive bred fish at these shows that you wouldn't be able to get at other places. Definitely the emphasis is on coral, but there'll be a lot of clownfish, um, even some captive bred angelfish you'll find at these shows, which if you find them online are either going to be super expensive or just really hard to track down. So going to one of these shows with a, a open mind for um, new animals that you might put in your tank like fish is definitely an interesting way to get some livestock. I thought that these were interesting. I had never seen glass frag plugs before. Uh, this vendor had what looked like cast glass uh, frag plugs, and you can see there's a little part of glass that comes up, and then the frag is glued to that. Um, so I thought that was an interesting way to mount coral. I had never seen this uh, style before, so I thought that was, that was an interesting idea. And did I mention that you can get just about anything at Reefapalooza? You can see there are zoanthids of all sorts, uh, Montiporas, Acroporas, LPS, all different sorts of things, lots of rock anemones, lots of real anemones, um, bounce mushrooms of all different colors. Uh, it was a really interesting way to, to get some new coral. So hopefully that was interesting. Let me know what you thought if you were at Palooza, And if you get a chance, I would definitely check it out when it is in your town. See you next week. Bye.